Hey there, Castor and Kev, and back in the saddle again. Happy New Year. Um, this is my first operation after the New Year, even though it's hard to adjust writing 2023 on things. I um, hope you got to enjoy it with, uh, you know, family, friends, or even alone, binging Netflix with a six pack. That sounds pretty sweet. But anyways, I am off to a estate sale in nearby town called Matuchen, which uh, actually stands for, it's German, it means vast vintage riches or something, I don't know, I'm hoping. Uh, Santa Claus got me a new camera, which is pretty cool. Um, my version of Santa Claus is five foot four, blonde and pretty, but she gifted me a new GoPro, so it means you'll be seeing every wrinkle, every gray hair, just really Thank clear. You. And you. All right. But um, the good news is it'll be uh, more steady and it'll be a clearer picture. So let's go find something to start this new year off the right way. All right, as soon as I get here, I have to attack the kitchen. That's what I do. I'm a professional, professional dishwasher, basically. Hmm. Wagner. Big logo lodge. Houses. Did you find any toys, dude? Uh, no. Wow, that's pretty. There's a lot of stuff, but... Hmm. Oh, I love these. Some of these are so expensive. It's some games. Yeah, but the cold ones are better. Yeah, we'll go upstairs, buddy. Let's take a look. Oh, That's a nice piece of furniture, I'll tell you what. Come here, bub. We're just exploring. and shoes, luggage, do you like that table, end table, now oh, where are you going? Man, that's a good shape. It better be. Of course you find something. Puppy. Yeah. I know what the, I must have collected these things. I know some people do. But, uh, pretty cool. And a car. Lots of vintage, uh, vintage clothes. I know there's a market for that stuff too, but. Hey, make yourself at home, kid. Books. That's real nice. Legos. Whoa! Look at the Legos, dude. I like it. Uh, ten. I think the Legos. Legos can come home with us. What do you think? Lego. Yeah. Lego. I'll come home. That's pretty, uh, pretty cool, but it's not my stuff. This is more my stuff. Tools that I have that I don't really need. 
for some stuff. Just really learn more about this stuff. I see this stuff a lot. All in box. In box, I mean, people pay extra for a box. Wow. Who's those guys? What's that guy doing? That's an elephant. And look, another elephant. Yeah, these aren't toys though. These are for display and they're very cool and heavy. And then why you touch it? Cost a few dollars more than your toys. Really nice. It's a nice regal dining room, man. Very formal. Mm. No. All right, stop, stop. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Good boy. Anchor hockey. Come here, Bob. Tons of glassware. Really nice color. <laughs> Look at all the spoons. Those are fancy spoons. Want a big spoon for cereal? Yeah. Yeah. You like that? That's not toy. It's really nice stuff. I just ventured outside here to see what's going on. It's a, uh, not a super old square. Maybe like 70s. Is that too big for you? But look at this stuff. That's real nice. Royal Iron Patio Set. I like this stuff. It just needs new, uh, new cushions. You're ready to go. Hey! Come on, Junior. Just love that color. How old? He's three and very curious. And we found some toys for him, so he's happy. <laughs> so found cute. some old fashioned Legos. So cute. You know that? Watches. Yeah, you know that? Wow. Hmm. Be safe, Kay. You want to pay for your Legos and hit the road? Or not pay attention? How do you find all the toys? Maybe after. That's a really nice shape. That reminds me of the first staplers that were used in school in the 80s and 90s. Which I know nothing of, but they're huge. I don't know, kid. I think we're better off with the Legos we have, okay? Alright, made it back from the estate sale. Um, there was a lot of cool stuff to see. I didn't score anything really because uh, I can't go early and wait in line and be one of the first people. So apparently I missed a number 10 Griswold Dutch oven. That would have been a nice score, but um, it was still neat to see. Uh, managed to score uh -oh. a box of vintage Legos. So I'll, have to, I'll have to look it up, but um, I don't think, I mean, I could probably, I got it for a good deal. I could probably clean them up and flip them for a profit but i think i'm going to hold on to them for the boys because they seem to enjoy it that's pretty cool but um i appreciate you people walking around with me um feel free to leave comments and suggestions like if i you know see something in my travels and i don't know about it say oh that bowl is very collectible or that glassware just leave a comment i love the interaction and learning about new things and uh, pretty much anything I can clean up, restore, sell, make a few bucks, and uh, more importantly, 
let these things live for another generation. You know, just uh, save pieces of history one at a time. But anyways, thanks for coming along. Please like and subscribe and all that stuff. Um, as always, I think we could all do better.